I have been trying to make it Christmassy. Short story time. So I bought these at the Dollar Tree. It's supposed to be five feet long. This is not five feet. This is like three feet. Friends, my name is Gabrielle. Welcome to Miss Reads. I'm really excited because, in the spirit of Christmas, I went ahead and bought myself a book box from Go Indy Now, the Bibliotherapy Box. If you look on it, the first thing that you see when you get it is your mental vacation has arrived, and I'm really excited to see because I would love a mental vacation. I should have opened it before I actually started this video because I am terrible at tearing these kind of look at it. It's like the ones where they're stuck together. Oh, come on now. Oh my god, there's three packages. It's a package inside a package inside a package. Oh! Okay, so the first thing I pulled out was this little note and it says my name on it. It says Gabrielle. Oh, I'm so excited. I want to see this little note. It feels so cute. It's a Christmas one. Oh, there's something in it. Hold on. Oh my god, it comes with an ornament! Look how cute that is! Oh, I love that! I love the little angel. I'm gonna try and hang it. Can I hang it up right here? Oh, perfect. I got it to hang right here on my little books. I love that! That is adorable! Okay, so that's my first thing I got, and then I also got this card. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Dear Gabrielle, I hope this box brings you love and joy. Love, Ashley. Ooh, this little package that's wrapped with these little cute paper. Oh, I love the little, um, I love the little snowman. Snowmen are my favorite. That's one of my favorite aesthetics about the winter Christmassy season is all the snowman. You guys, if you haven't seen my last video, it's a reaction to the Spider-Man Homecoming trailer, and I have my little snowman Charlie in it because Christian wasn't able to be there that day. Okay, let's see. Oh, here's the Go Indie Now book box bringing you a mental vacation each month. I'll go ahead and show you guys the business card there. And then, oh, it's a pin. It says, let your soul stand cool and composed before a million universes. Oh, I like this pin a lot. Okay. Oh, it's another little wrapped package in the snowman paper. I love these. I'm like, I'm gonna reuse these gift bags because I have a couple little gifts that would go great in this for my family. Shh, don't tell them that. Oh, well, okay, I was going to reuse it, but then I ended up having to rip it because the tape was being difficult. Okay, ooh, this feels cool. Ah, what is this? Adventure scents. Ooh, oh, is this something you can smell? Oh my gosh, this smells amazing. What scent is this? It's okay, so it's a little like scent package. I actually have no idea what this is. I think it's just something that you just put in and it smells of the room, but that's super cute. I like that. Time. I don't know which one this one is. I think it's just, maybe it's just adventure scent. It smells pretty good. And they have so many different scents. That's so cool. The next thing I have is this library card. I think that might be the book that I got. And then there's a little note from the CEO of Go Indie Now with all the stuff that is included. And apparently the theme this month is the concept of fallen angels, the world, the universe, and everything it contains. So that's pretty cool and I think they've done a good job with that so far. And now, finally, the most exciting part is the book, which is wrapped in such a pretty little package. I love that, I love the little bow. Ah, oh, I hate unwrapping things because it's always so pretty when I get it and then afterwards it's just torn apart. It's that matte cover feel too, which is amazing. That's like the best kind of cover. Before a Million Universes by T.W.R. Shelton, who is the same person who signed the library card. So that's really cool. I like how they did that. This book, I actually have no idea what this book is about because it doesn't really... Oh, here we go. It's the summary of this book is winged creatures are falling from the sky, untruths are surfacing, and a city is dying. 17-year-old Maxwell Odyssey never wanted to save the world. Now she has no choice. So it sounds like a dystopian YA novel mixed in with a lot of angelic mythology. So that's really cool. And I love angelic mythology because it's one that's not really explored that much in different books. I think it's gonna be really good. I'm excited to read this. So that is my book haul from Go Indie Now Bibliotherapy. I think I might actually keep this book as a subscription box. I usually try and try out every kind of a subscription box that I hear of first, but this is one that I really liked and I got a lot of stuff. So I might keep this one in the future. I'm really excited to use all this. This is awesome. I'm very satisfied with this subscription box. I will leave all the links to lead you to it and for where you can find more information about it in the description down below so make sure you guys go ahead and check that out if you haven't already heard of them if you guys haven't seen my last video then make sure you stick around because it will be playing right after this if you guys haven't subscribed to my channel already then you definitely should because not only do I upload bookish videos twice a week but I also upload reaction videos whenever something cool comes out that I want to react to and usually my friend Christian is appearing in them so you guys can always look forward to seeing him but that's all I have for you guys today so thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you guys later okay so if you can't tell by the fact that I still have Halloween decorations back in the background, it's kind of been a while since I've recorded a video.